Pardon me. Would you have any gray poupon? Well, you can do school or you can do drugs, but you really can't do both. Read Dianetics by L. Ron Hubbard, the owner's manual for the human mind. <laughs> we gotta crank this. My name is Bob. <laughs> My name is Bob. <laughs> Wow, dude. Really great stuff, man. I like <laughs> Bev. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. This is, the, this is seriously the best, like, retirement shit ever. <laughs> yeah. Get a green I've seen other, Yeah, I've seen a karaoke a machine. <laughs> yeah. these, there, I mean, there's probably a few pairs of these every generation. Yeah. <laughs> And what a privilege it is to, you know, to be around for this one. To be alive at the same time as Bob and Bob. And <laughs> what a fucking dude, blessing, My dude. name is Bob. <laughs> <laughs> I think a green screen can uh, increase an old person's life by like 15 yeah, years. Yeah, this is like, know? this is the most, uh, <laughs> this is the best way to not get dementia. Yeah. <laughs> this yeah. is guaranteeing a healthy brain. You have to read, you, you have to like sing. Sudoku. <laughs> You're improvising. Crossword <laughs> puzzles. <laughs> yeah, dude. You guys hang out in the garden. I'll be in front of the fucking green screen. <laughs> I'll be in the basement. <laughs> well, uh, Bev throw one ball with the ball one time. <laughs> they have a whole catalog of other songs. Yes. Wigger. Yep. Mm -hmm. I feel like I've seen this one before. She's not even doing the whisper. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You are the. <laughs> Bev's my favorite. <laughs> Whoa, she, is she dressed like Chun Li? <laughs> wow, man. This is this is modern Americana. <laughs> it really is. <laughs> This is sick. She's kind of dressed like uh, she's dressed like she's from the future. <laughs> <laughs> well, they're traveling through time. <laughs> True, dude. Yeah. <laughs> Damn, he's driving the big rig through time. I welcome, love him. welcome back to Tim Butterly's show, friends. <laughs> Noah and I uh, are pleased as punch today to bring to you. I mean, an extremely special friend of ours. This is, I mean, talk about a fucking meteoric rise. You know what I mean? It's like, <laughs> yeah. this dude, this dude is a like walking self-fulfilling prophecy. <laughs> it's not, the trajectory is honestly, it, it strains your neck to even observe it. I, I, listen to me, you, you fucking guest Hank mongoloids. Yeah, <laughs> MIG idiot. welding at 6.45 in the morning right now listening to this. I want you to seriously <laughs> smash your equipment, break your helmet, and blind <laughs> yourself for our guest. Ah, ah. One of the best dudes ever. <laughs> fucking Sean Gardner. <laughs> hey, guys. hey, guys, what's up? What's going thanks on, Sean? Thanks, thanks, thanks for hanging out. Dude, thanks, thanks for making for time me. with us, man. No, it's crazy, yo, it's crazy watching you walk the streets of Philadelphia and people are just fucking mobbing you wherever you go. That's not what it is. crazy. Dude, the king has returned. I, yeah, it's <laughs> nuts, dude. It's the. <laughs> yeah. Truth. This is the return. I uh, wow, man. <laughs> talk talk about a real Bob and Bev moment. <laughs> <laughs> being, able to, being able to watch this close up is pretty fucking cool, dude. <laughs> but Siri, I, but I'm I, and I'm realizing it sounds like I'm fucking with you. But this is wow, dude. Pretty cool. You're literally you guys glowing cool. with your red suit on. We're, I'm giving it up for you, man. I appreciate it. I love you guys. What a what a big time. What a big time packed shit. Like. Uh, uh, you know when a when a room just feels like heavy, when it feels like <laughs> whoa, no one can breathe in here. That's what you just did last night. I got to see it. I cool. was so sweaty. Yeah, it was, it was hot, and there my were a lot of were fat people there. Off my nose just the whole time. There were a lot of fat people struggling to breathe. <laughs> that's okay though. But I, like I said though, it's like that's an achievement. That's what I'm saying. You hit a you you rang the bell at the top of the hammer game yeah, well, last night. Pretty cool. You know me. I try not to enjoy anything, <laughs> <laughs> but I appreciate that. And I, am happy. <laughs> I am very happy and grateful and all that good stuff. Mm -hmm. No, I I am I'm, I, you know I have the same uh, I have the same 
uh, inclinations as you to <laughs> really avoid uh, taking anything in, but you should, man. Uh, sure. That was that we what we were just watching was uh, our guy <laughs> from last week, Silverback Tarzan. <laughs> If you guys remember, if you guys forgot in the week that just happened, we were watching this old jacked guy who is living maybe the ultimate post-divorce life. The Brexit geezer. It's he, <laughs> true Brexit geezer. <laughs> <laughs> he, you know, he learned he learned a lot in the divorce, and you know, it's about moving on every day. You know, it's just you know, and mm -hmm. so he's just the most free. <laughs> jacked old dude ever and uh he's from northern england right? <laughs> no way dude southeast england get oh, it right. shit. i shouldn't yeah known. do you even have dude. a passport no i don't have a passport, passport, dude? passport no actually yeah, i do <laughs> but you have a passport he yeah look at his face dude. his look most look recent shit up he got. we were just trying yeah. to enjoy his whole vibe and in his most recent shit his 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 grill was busted oh, my dude Atlanta. it was th that was day Absolutely well, busted the, grill. The, um, Weird scares for less. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Damn, that's what he calls PTSD. <laughs> it almost looks fake, uh, right? Yeah. And he's just like, you know, sometimes, <laughs> sometimes your face gets fucking cut off, mate. It's, <laughs> it's about getting up, disconnecting yourself from the hang glider, and walking towards the nearest person and using their phone. <laughs> <laughs> and it's so motivational and shit. And uh, but we we didn't breaking news up breaking update. We have video of the hang gliding crash that did this to him, <laughs> not this one. <laughs> Uh, also, his face looks... He's recovering kind of extremely well. I yeah. i know that he's doing some... I know that he's sitting in like a uh, a straw hut with like a specific <laughs> incense burning and he's meditating 15 hours a day. He's levitating. Uh, he's, yeah. Dude, he's... Man they didn't put a single stitch in his face. He <laughs> manually bridged the gap in his skin for meditation <laughs> and being jacked. But life, we got risks. it. You have to take risks in life. When you first started walking... He could have fallen over, he was going to fall over. He took the risk to stand up to learn to walk. When you jump in a car, you risk crashing your car. Everything you do in life has got mad risks. <laughs> that was him before the crash, by the yeah. way. <laughs> he called it. He oh said, my god, he's going to jump off the That being said, watch this. <laughs> oh my god, he's going to crash? But he's, he, you, you think he's going to crash, but he cooks for a while. He's yeah. just soaring right now? Yeah, he's hang gliding. <laughs> I feel like a seagull. Is that what he just said? <laughs> Look how sad I, the British ocean is. <laughs> oh, lonely day on the beach, isn't it? <laughs> We got a bunch of rain, it all just <laughs> gathered up in this big hole. <laughs> yeah, I can't do good accents, but... Absolutely dreary. <laughs> I'm 16 inches above the rocks. <laughs> Is that Still feeling confident. He nosedives into the fucking rocks? Yeah. No, no, no he hits sand. That's oh. so scary. Although that cliff is nuts. Isn't this crazy? No, he talks about how he's like, oh yeah, I love just like pretending to race the cars that are on the highway right next to me. <laughs> he's like, I like to be like, oh yeah. This is insane. I mean, don't you want to go hang gliding though? <laughs> no, I no, never, not never. at all. Oh, I want to go so this bad. This scares me so it's bad. So are these scary. the white cliffs of Dover? <laughs> I don't know. Is that what that is? I don't know, but this is... Dover. So what does he turn back in the other direction? Yeah, right he now? turns back around because there's like a city on that side. So he's like, oh, I got to turn around to avoid it. Was that just a warning beep? <laughs> his gear, his gear knows it's over. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty sudden. Does he not know? <laughs> he's talking shit to birds. <laughs> <laughs> he's still chilling right now. <laughs> Dude, he's uh, yeah, he is crow, 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 that crow. Oi! Oi, crow! <laughs> Fuck that crow. Hey! This crow's trying to bust me up. Eh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, jog on! <laughs> uh, piss off. <laughs> piss off, crow. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. 
but I'm still, I would give anything to trade places with him. He's cooking. He, he crashes because he tries to snatch the crow. Yeah. He's going, oh. <laughs> His skull's exposed. I can't believe he's Almost like... at him. <laughs> no, I wouldn't be filming. I would be so scared. I'd be holding on for dear he's life. He's been in the air for so long. I know. He's never coming down. I wonder if he forgot that he was in the air. <laughs> Did he turn? He's turned back again. Because he only has a certain amount of uh, area where he can hang glide. Oh, I see. Wow. I think I see a little Dude. girl on a blanket enjoying the warm day on the beach. <laughs> I'm going to crash into her. <laughs> Lovely. Brilliant. Smash. <laughs> He's a kamikaze. <laughs> How nuts would it be to land on the road? <laughs> On your feet. <laughs> <laughs> you just hop and you take yeah. it off again like a kite. <clears throat> Dude, I would, my, I would seriously, I would, I would give up 10 years of my life to be this guy for a day. <laughs> no way. No way. Just for a day. You're a lunatic. <laughs> Yo, I'm telling you. You can be this guy. I I would give up 10 years of your life. <laughs> you could easily be this guy, I think. You just need a hang glider. I give you hang anything. out. You hang out in your basement all the time already. <laughs> <laughs> you're constantly listening to m music and doing moves in your basement. <laughs> like you're doing that already. <laughs> <laughs> you're constantly like hitting fight stances. Like, you are doing that just day to day. And he's always trying to get us jacked. <laughs> yeah, true. That's your whole thing. This is going to be this huge. Is just you too. You just need a hang glider. I'm so and, back and Tarzan Junior. Just you. British you. Wow. <laughs> this is such a long build-up. Yeah, I know. Oh, I well, because he rides for a while. He's just yeah. hanging out. This, yeah, this video is actually more of a conversation piece, like a like a nice coffee table in the yeah, background true, that yeah. we, you know, we, we kind of just like sit that. around. You know, <laughs> Danny, I'm sorry. I'm giving you a task to really adjust the levels in post so that this is <laughs> enjoyable and not the worst content of all time. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm pretty sure this has looped at some point. I no, think it started it out. Hasn't. Is this still the same descent? <laughs> yeah, he, he, it's, he's gliding. It's England. It's the windiest place if in the world. Went, if you just went straight, you could go a million miles. Probably. Oh, oh no. Oh, and no. Look how fast the ground's going. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, oh no, shit. Oh, no. Oh, oh. no. Oh, oh. <laughs> but guess what? Oh, my God. Yeah, but guess what? He just walks it off. <laughs> ah. It's nothing to him, dude. <laughs> it's fine. Through the power of positivity, I will get through this. <laughs> oh, what's his first words? <laughs> oh dear God! Heavens! <laughs> well, that's the end of that. Smash my fucking face up. <laughs> well, that's the end of that. Smash my fucking face up. And the wind dropped out. <laughs> yeah, this guy's the best. <laughs> It's nothing to him. <laughs> He's kind of like, well, the risk. This was a minor inconvenience for him. Yeah, I got real scars for life. I wonder how often he's That'll do, then. Seen you smashed up me face. Scars for life. Scares for life. Scares. You can cut yourself and it'll all go back together and weigh up, and then you can do things that you need to do because you know that you mend. So have a great day. You too. Funny, I've done a risk risk video before. Life, you need <laughs> <Bro>. <laughs> he made a video about Life, making about taking walking. risks. Crashed his hand <laughs> <laughs> and then buttoned it up before seeking medical attention. It's almost <laughs> like he crashed on purpose, just because yeah. yeah. he made that video and then he's like, "I need a climax and I need a conclusion <laughs> yeah. for this." Yeah. He stayed up all night thinking of an ending. Oh, I'll yeah. Crash. I'll pitch into the fucking gravel. <laughs> <laughs> he should have went into the ocean, swam back. That's what I thought, but yeah. then I think I'd be terrified of drown. Or Well, yeah, he's attached to this hang glider that's just sinking. I don't know. He probably also has a point in there about like not taking the easy way of splashing down. Instead, mm -hmm. sacrifice your grill. <laughs> yeah. For what you really want, the money maker. Sean's right though. We should have just landed on the road and tried to run through it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> or did a roll or something. Mm -hmm. Yeah, or up, up. on top of like a truck. That'd be cool. Up, yeah. up. I think people would respect <laughs> that. So yeah, that's the latest on True, our yeah. Spider-Man landing on top of like an eighteen-wheeler. <laughs> <laughs> that's the that's the update on our hero, Silverback Tarzan, mm -hmm. the best to ever do it. It's our dad. 
Look how fucking jacked he Yo. is, dude. Yo. Sorry, that's the end. Oh, that's all. Bobby Kennedy, buddy. Yeah. Training all the time. Training and moving. And dude. Swelling my eyes up. It's not letting me do the things I would normally do. Like eating so pussy. I have to to my habits. <laughs> He's talking about. No, that's not the best thing all the time. Your habits are not needed every day, and they're not the best thing for you sometimes. So make sure you're taking note of what's really useful for you, what's really good for you. So don't do yourself in through habitual, habitual life. Notice yourself and think about yourself. He's saying shave things up. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I can get behind that. Shave yeah, things up, dude. Show your fucking... Hard. Your dick V. And it takes traumatic events to show you what's really important. Training. This is what I want. Training. All of my... I'm saying... I'm not saying I want to be this. I'm saying all of my friends have to be this guy. <laughs> when we get old. And but you're you him. Well, you might as well start now. You're basically him, though. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> uh, you're him. <laughs> but... Uh, I mean... Am I, I'm, am I burdened with being him? <laughs> is that my thing? Is that my is that my lot? <laughs> Could I guess be. so. Fuck. I'd love to crash a hang glider. You can, man. But it's already been done. I gotta yeah, go bigger. You have to him. crash something else, yeah. I'm gonna crash fucking, like a hot air balloon. I was gonna say blow no, up we already blimp. know a guy who crashed a hot air balloon and killed somebody. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna detonate a blimp. <gasps> yeah. <laughs> yeah, we met a guy that crashed a hot air balloon and killed his best friend. Oh. Isn't that terrible? And he was in a coma for like six weeks. And, he, and I asked him to be on my show and he, he watched Field Trip and he said, I understand you're trying to be funny. I just don't want to be involved with this. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah, that was pretty bad. He also, he's he, he, a, a lot of stuff, dude. He's killed his friends. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Dude. Oh, he doesn't. It's not funny that someone died in a hot air balloon accident. He wears cool hats and rides a Segway. We did want to talk to him so bad. <laughs> we actually wanted him. He kind of saw he doing it. just riding wacky modes of transportation around. <laughs> no, and the way he rides Segway, hot air balloons, hot air he, yeah. balloons. he doesn't use a basket for hot air balloons. He straps himself into like a bench. He's here, yeah, he's and sitting goes on like no a, walls. He's sitting on a two person metal bench strapped to a balloon that he made himself. And he kind of soft offered to like show us how to make a hot air balloon. And we we with, it almost happened. Mm -hmm. But whew, you know. we have other hot air balloon connects though. Mm. Yeah, but that was he was him. Yeah, that guy he was him. That would have been something. He else. measures things in like sizes of girls. Oh yeah, yeah, what? yeah. He'll be like yeah. that. He'll be like, you see that? That's the size of this girl here. Yeah, yeah. You <laughs> see that? You see that? The arrow pattern near the top of the balloon. Each of those arrows is about the size of a girl. <laughs> we were like, okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he was telling us, dude. His brother, uh, his brother built some uh, at a hot air balloon festival. His oh, brother, yeah. He cool. told us about his uh, twin brother. Was yeah, his twin? yeah, his twin. And he, his twin brother, uh, built some. Um, and they married twins. Observatory. His brother huh? engineered an observatory. Yeah, he he had a twin brother, and they married twin sisters. Yeah, isn't that crazy? He, he carries said, four. Look alike, and he he said, carries no. four wedding photos in his wallet, mm -hmm. and he goes, "What's the difference between the, these?" And I go, "You got me, man." He goes. <laughs> It's four different people, and I went, "What?" Yeah. Anyway, his twin, you've got to be kidding me. His twin brother engineered a uh, on, on some fucking observatory somewhere. It's at he, his house, I think. Yeah, and he goes, he goes, th the lens at the top of the mag at the top of the mi magnifying or what is it called telescope? Telescope. He goes, the lens itself, it's like the size of a girl. <laughs> 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 <Yeah>. <laughs> I don't what? know. How, uh, yeah, yeah. He, he hit that at least, and I'm and saying, I was the I, si and I was the size of a of a, a <laughs> candle oh, on a birthday cake hot air balloon. And he yeah. would point at girls and be like, "She could fit in there." Yeah, she could <laughs> fit in there. She'd be like the yeah, the lens itself. That girl could stand in it. <laughs> like he's just like eyeballing girls. Yeah, she most, like that's the most size. peculiar man of all time. He loved to like set you up for something like that too. He had so many like plot points that he knows he needs to hit. <laughs> Yeah, and he'd be like, "What do you think of this website? This is my I might website. Hit him up again. I, I invented websites." I'm gonna, I'm gonna hit him up one more time. You this should. Dude, this dude was so fucking compelling. He really is. Yeah, <laughs> I'm interested. I might tell him like I'm, I, and then he lives around your way. Yeah, he lives He's by Texas. Rutgers. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe I'll go try to put in a good word for you guys. Please, dude. We're gonna send you as our emissary. Yeah. Dude. He was one of the first people to have email. Yeah, he they was all like, say. he was like, on but the, I think yeah. he did. But I think it was like '70s. I bought it though. I bought in. I mean, it's fun, more fun to believe. He told us he invented the GPS for Apple Maps. <laughs> yeah, Dude, that was Sean, the Sean's currently dressed has a hot air balloon. <laughs> 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 he might yeah. be the perfect Shout representative. Really. Yeah, I will yeah. go. I will go to dress Show like, up like this. that, dude. Be like, hey, brother. <laughs>
You want to take me up? <laughs> Let's do it. Man, not the Marlboro Miles, though. T- yeah, take shout me up. out Let's Big Willie. <laughs> Took me up with yeah, this. Yeah, King Soul rules, dude. King Willie. He is. The, he truly is the king. He he's, might be, he seriously might be the hypest dude on the planet. Yeah, he's yeah. the man. Thank I you. get so excited whenever I see him. He always pops up in the most random places. Yeah, he's yeah. the man. Yeah, so that's 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 the update on, on Silverback Tarzan. Um, <laughs> sorry, guys. I'm really hungover. I'm sorry. I'm. What are you sorry for? No, dude, you're so high energy right now. Is it? A, <laughs> what the hell? What the hell? I'm, no, you're doing good. <laughs> I'm trying. I'm saying that's good. What do you think my show sucks? Is that does this suck? No, no. Are no. we having a bad time? No, just Noah hasn't been painting, and I worry it's because oh. he's been talking. And he's got I've plenty no, of time. No, no, no. He's I, always got time to spare. Yeah, no. I uh, the paintings are based off of the episode, so it's oh, based okay. off of something I hear. Yeah. Well, okay. uh. Do you guys? Bah, what the, bah, I what have the another. I have another joking? motivational guy. He's got guy. fake face. Whoa! Yeah, I think this guy's head this got blown kinda, off. This, in the his war. head got blown off. But hold on! But hold on! Sad. He's got a little bit of wisdom for us that I wanted to share. I'm, I kind of forgot that he was horribly disfigured. I just wanted to share the motivation thing, if that's okay. Yeah, fucking right, dude. <laughs> I don't. I can't, ah! I can't watch this no, kind of stuff. No, stop man. that, <laughs> Tim. You're gonna come out of it. I can't watch this kind of stuff. No, this is. Hold on, stuff, Ready? Dude. <laughs> I really can't look at that right now. That dark place. That Damn, Sean's gonna throw up. I'm about to, No, gonna I'm not gonna throw up. He's beautiful. <laughs> I don't look at hurt him. his feelings. I can't look at him. I can't, him. I can't even like beautiful. process what he's saying. You're gonna come out of it better than you were before. Mm-hmm. <sighs> that storm you're going through. I fucking bars. Hate you. There's a sunny day with clear skies on the other side of it. I'm here to let you know mm-hmm. you are not alone. Put your trust in the Lord. I Just feel so bad for him. Things. He doesn't feel bad for what him. What happened to his Don't goddamn nose? Thoughts get to you. Was he a veteran? Yeah, I think he might still be. I think he returned to duty. Seek the How kingdom. The fuck? Oh, Seek the gosh. kingdom. Dude, Seek righteousness know. and righteousness. Let him. Let him go. I mean, dude. God bless his heart. Will be given to you, dude. <laughs> dude, <laughs> he's gonna make me throw up. first. This is important stuff. You Shut have up, to have trust. <laughs> it starts with trust, Noah. Scares me. Less yeah, dude, learned, I can't. I can never this is scary. Right it's like, okay, man, maybe, maybe wrap it up. <laughs> he's making you look at him like that's a thing. And it's like, why not, man? He's you know, he's still a person, dude. But he's fucking. And the things that were once bothersome. (laughs) I hate this so much. (laughs) Why? He's so gross. I'm already a little bit queasy. Leave him alone, dude. I I thought you guys would like this. Shut the fuck up. (laughs) I thought I was this guy, not the last guy. (laughs) (laughs) Me and this guy. You're not this. This is the vibe. This is not the vibe. That's the vibe. It, it, Tim, that's not the vibe. Oh man, it looks like he tried to that's kiss an a vibe. Do you prefer him? Like, there there you go. Is that lips. better? Yeah. No. Not now he looks like Hannibal Lecter, dude. That kind of bums me out too. Hmm. I mean, it does. It does make me feel better that I can't. If you get an, a hat that casts a good enough shadow on your face, I think that's fine. <laughs> like if you're mostly just a shadow and maybe the, the the you know the vague silhouette of a nose like this, I think you're chilling. Yeah, he's fine this way. This you is know? fine. I mean, yeah, I feel really bad for him. He's probably walking around and kids are probably terrified. <laughs> I'm serious. No, you're absolutely right. You're right. You're right. <laughs> that sucks. I'd man. be really scared if I saw him in public. I would be no, really. You would. Yes, I would. I dude. would. I swear to God, I would. I would run as fast as <laughs> I can. No, dude. he's scary. I no. I would. Okay. I, I know exactly easily. what I would do. If I was like in line at the bank and I saw him, I'd go. I would make a face really quick and I'd stop it. I'd stop so fast, but there would be a split second where I went. And then I would I would go uh uh-uh. uh. I think humana, if I was at the and then I would, I would and be... then I would I would act like nothing was drawing my attention while I was standing in line and I would just keep looking at him and then I would just keep moving around and then back and then on him again and I would just be like you're just blending into the background man you yeah. know I think if I saw him at the bank well, it would that's be nice. easier to <laughs> deal with than if I saw him in public I do the same thing with uh, little people and oh, uh, man, I always laugh at those guys I feel bad. Yeah, I like to point at them. Yeah, whenever I'm with my girlfriend, I'm always like, no, bro, that's crazy. <laughs> no, you shouldn't laugh. I know I shouldn't laugh. I know it's bad. But you can point. <laughs> you just go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I do this. Yeah, I think people have the same reaction to seeing horses and seeing little people. You go, hey, 
Check it out. Uh, <laughs> midget. <laughs> hey, uh, say hey, that word. Hey, real quick. Wanted to, just wanted to make LP. sure you didn't miss the little person. <laughs> yeah, really there. <laughs> There's a little person in the food court. Everyone, get your eyes on it just real quick. <laughs> <laughs> I just want right, to make sure. It, all right. Everyone look hey, once. everybody. He's just like us. You don't see a lot of these, okay? <laughs> it could be a long time before you see another one. I just want to make sure different. everyone. He's different. Check him out. <laughs> And not even saying one thing one way or another on him, just making sure everyone observes. That's all. <laughs> I observe little people. Your eyes. Does this guy yeah. not have a nose? No, he has no nose. He looks like Voldemort. <laughs> <laughs> He's black Voldemort. <laughs> He's scary. I'm sorry, dude. Thank you for your service. It's Sergeant Voldemort to you. I really respect this man. No, that boy He's don't got no damn nose. <laughs> but I just... You know? No, it's scary. Where does motherfucker's nose go? Where's it with pride, dude? <laughs> Stop. He looks like that. He, what's that, Stop. what's the name of that? The, what's the name of that? Like the dude from Star Wars, the King Droid guy. What's his name? What? You Grievous? know what I'm talking about? General Grievous. General Grievous. Oh uh, yes. Oh yeah. yeah he, he looks, has four <laughs> looks arms. like General Grievous. <laughs> he has four arms for four lightsabers. Damn. No nose. Four arms. <laughs> I'm sorry. I respect this guy, but he doesn't have four arms, but he has a third leg. Hey, let's <laughs> grab it. Uh, Noah, you're grounded, man. I'm just, you know, I you you, you're bringing this to me, dude. <laughs> this is I nuts. thought this, I thought this uh, was like I thought maybe I could just for once be a little bit serious and just show you guys something you know good and cool. And you guys like, made fun of it. That fuck just off, fucking dude. sucks. <laughs> I'm not making fun of it. I just I my, you're I'm not. A little queasy. Here's what I here's I'm how I think about like that. I'm a little no. queasy right He's now. He's bleeding. <laughs> <laughs> Stop. No, I don't like looking at this. <laughs> yeah, I don't feel so good. My stomach hurts. You're kind of a monster for this. <laughs> yeah, I've been having a... I you know, knew I'd react I knew. this way to this. <laughs> <laughs> Did you know exactly how we would react to this, Tim, before we put it on? No! Give it to me straight. You guys have shocked me and disappointed me, to be honest. You're a well, monster, dude. Disappoint. We're not the monsters. You're the monster. <laughs> you guys know the you're kind of guy I am. I see this and I go right on. And you guys are just like mocking me and basically making me feel gay about it. You know? <laughs> well, that's just, I, I guess that's do. what my friends really fucking think of me. <laughs> okay. Yeah, can, can we look at Bob and Bev again? <laughs> yeah, I need a palate cleanser, please. <laughs> I don't so know scary. if I have a palate I'm sorry. cleanser. I'm sorry to that guy, and but he's so It's scary. all bad stuff this week. <laughs> I'm so scared today. Do you know? Uh, do you know the videos of the little girl with Arfid and she tries new foods? Who's Arfid? What the hell's Arfid? Arfid is this disease where these kids are like really like uh, they they think so much stuff is yucky and they're like scared of it. I think it's just being that's me. I think years so old. I think so too. Does, I, oh, Fritz has Arfid. Then. I think so too, but hmm. it's like a whole thing. And this little girl like tries these new foods that she's like afraid of. And sometimes she likes it and sometimes she doesn't. And it's pretty nice. And she's like, I always take three bites because, you know, uh, at least I could say I'm proud of myself that I tried it. And, you know, if I that don't like nice. it, I don't like it. And it's like really that. nice. Man. Yeah, kids' brains are fucked up. Yeah. You know? Yeah, definitely. Be, I mean... I mean, they just got to learn stuff, you know? There's a there's a mental currency... Uh, that I'm dealing with 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 Fritz, where I know I can I can get a little bit more out of him like effort wise than anything if I just dangle big boy praise to him. Oh hell yeah! Like big kid, like ooh man, you really reminded me of a big kid right there. He goes, <laughs> nice. He goes, yeah, yeah thanks. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, dude, it's it's heart stopping. If I go, whoa, are you, you're like a big kid. He goes. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Fritz is the sweetest boy I've ever met. Yeah, I know. People hate when you talk about that kind of stuff, though. So <laughs> I, would, I want to talk about that. I don't want to look at the same no, no, no. Okay, I, yeah, I, he's I, so sweet. I Remember when we were at nice... Nifty Fifties and he couldn't open up the door for himself because he was so small. <laughs> <laughs> 
very heavy bathroom door at Nifty Fifty. Yeah, and he was really talking. Like I was talking to him the whole day, and then he was, and then he had to go to the bathroom and he couldn't lift the door. And I remember I looked at him and I was like, "Damn, for such a big personality, you forget how small he actually really is." <laughs> that was a little boy. He basically he's, called him a bitch. Yeah, yeah. but he's just you know he he he's he's so like yeah. well, he's yeah. so cognizant. You know, yeah. it's a pretty bizarre. He's, sharp. he's a pretty bizarre creature. I love showing him to people, man. <laughs> <laughs> well, so if you if you if he gets like bashful when you call him a big boy if you if you said he's acting like a little boy would he be i would never oh my god dude what do you oh, think getting, he would do get though? called a little boy could you imagine if i did that That would piss me off you're acting like a little boy right now oh my god dude. i'd spaz i'd freak out that would yeah, be an I'd arrow get, <sighs> that would be an arrow straight through the sternum not a little boy a little boy then stop telling me i'm doing all this big boy stuff <laughs> if i'm a little i opened the door before <laughs> i pulled really hard <laughs> I know Damn. it looks easy to you, but for me, it's pretty tough, and I did it. Damn, no. So I was, I was trying. I had to explain this to Mary Jo, and I don't know if anyone else would think the the reveal on this is funny. But have you heard of um, the um, Amazon has those uh, like little grocery stores with the just walk out technology? Yeah, I've, yeah, they have those in NYC. Yeah, I used to go to them. And you sometime. walk in and you scan your phone, or you you give over like your palm print, like you're yeah. going into a like a government facility, yeah. which is crazy to me. Yeah, and you go in and you just take so you just take what you need and you walk out and it automatically knows what you took, and it and your credit card gets charged like six and, bucks and it gets charged, you know, exactly the right price and there's no transaction. You just walk out, and I watched I I th what what really I think was going on was uh Amazon was trying to they were just trying to sell this to other, they wanted like every supermarket to to buy into uh, this technology I yeah think. whole foods has that shit. yeah and so they they had this like presentation and stuff where like the the design lead of the team of the just walk out system <laughs> explained how they have these cameras with computer vision and these shelves that detect like minute differences in weight and pressure and mm. it knows exactly and everything is like fully integrated and it's like you know it, it was a real sales pitch mm -hmm. and um they i i just saw a uh an article today that they're bailing on it they're taking out it out of the amazon fresh stores because uh it was revealed that the the actual technology was a thousand indian people watching the cameras in a call center really that was all they were doing <laughs> is this a joke no, i swear to god real. dude dude amazon's just walk out technology relies on hundreds of workers in india watching you shop. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> That's even better than the supercomputers. The... Yeah, it's like you can't get rid of humans that easy, dude. <laughs> you know? Oh, I love that so much. What a what a bamboozle that would have been. If that like took off and they had it in every store and they just had to keep hiring more and more Indian slaves to I watch mean, you on camera. There's plenty to go around. <laughs> They're kind of being like resourceful. <laughs> Danny said that uh, they were they were watching all the cameras that were in the floor, <laughs> like they're in the in the bathrooms. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I I don't know. There's just something about the reveal of the next. You know, they made it sound very AI. Just pulling the mask off. I wonder how much, of, how much of AI is seriously just uh, like That's what I'm Indian to think crowdsourcing. Too. Uh, I hope all of it, man. I I really like that. I like the Indian guys secretly carrying Amazon Fresh. AI has never existed. It's just different companies one-upping each other with Indian guy technology. Yeah. AI stands for <laughs> an Indian. <laughs> <laughs> an Indian guy. <laughs> wow, man. <laughs> 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 That's so <laughs> crazy. <laughs> they had to stop they before it became really MI, many Indians. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> TMI. <laughs> Too many Indians. Um, yeah. Oh my Hold god, on. imagine what that room smelled like. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I was going to say that was they they hacked the system by uh you were able to shoplift by taking whatever you want and then you could lose them in the deodorant aisle. <laughs> 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 oh, do you think they're yeah. just getting hungry all day looking at all that food? So they had to keep ordering food. Or they're just farting one. it up. <laughs> we'll detect items removed from shelves by a consumer and we'll add that item to their virtual cart. They were just the lying the, the whole back, time. Whether detect any change in weight, yeah. Why are they lying like that? 
These sensors reconcile data with computer vision. Computer vision. <laughs> that's not a real, that's not a real, if that, if that had capital letters in the beginning, I would go, oh, someone invented something and named it computer vision. <laughs> computer vision's not, that doesn't refer to anything <laughs> yeah. that I've heard of. Why couldn't they just be like, yeah, we got a bunch of Indian guys like looking through cameras. Yeah, and it's like, like eventually, you know, it'll be cheaper to use AI, but for now. Yeah, it's like, you know how every time you call, somebody calls for our company, it, it goes to Indian guys, it's the same thing. Yeah, I yeah. want to watch a camera on the guys watching the cameras. That would be a nice that would be the best job content. ever. Yeah. Ooh. No, just like a, a reality TV show where it's just five hundred Indian guys <laughs> watching people shop in like New York City. I I think I think it would be, I I think it would be de destabilizing to observe that like the the scale of humanity. <laughs> Crowded around identical workstations. <laughs> yeah, that's like when you see those TikTok farms in China, where it's just like a warehouse full of like twenty-year-old Chinese girls, like streaming on twenty different platforms at once. Yeah, yeah, that's kind of bumming me out. <laughs> you don't like that? I thought it was cool. I'm getting scared again. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's dude, great. we gotta stop scaring Sean. <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't think the show was so dark and twisted until the last couple of weeks, I guess. But if it seems like it <laughs> it's is. It's not! <laughs> I, uh, I, I love Indian guys. I'm so happy. <laughs> Are well, you no, an Indian they, food guy? It got shut down. No. Really? The, the, the Indian guy experiment has been a failure. They what shut are they going to the do now? Why is it a is it a failure just because everyone found out about the Indian guys? I think so. Yes, I think, I think what happened was uh, the Indian guy thing was about to be revealed, and Amazon went, "We're actually shutting this down. It's just like we're not even really into it anymore. <laughs> so whatever anyone says, it doesn't even matter. It's, it's totally not anymore. I mean, it's like kind of like, would people really care that much if they found out it was just Indian guys? Because it's like I don't know. You're just shopping. They're kind of like, "Yep, you bought that. You bought that. What if you got to buy condoms?" <laughs> <laughs> People get so embarrassed because the Indian guy sees them buy condoms. Yeah, I don't know. I, 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 uh, you know, I, I want more Indian guys in my life. Me too. I, I feel like I'm, I'm not dealing with them enough. I saw two of my best Indian friends yesterday. Really? Mm -hmm. How's he doing? <laughs> There's two of them. Whoa. Sahil and Navan. Shout out. Shout out. Yeah, they're the best bros. And but I've been on that shit. I've been on that shit for a long time. Everybody knows that about me. Yeah. So I yeah I put them back in. Let them just you know. What if they miss me? Put me in. Bro. What, if, what if what what if one of them I'm got really attached to me day. and watching me shop, <laughs> and you cut you cut me off from him. <laughs> now he just let, you know well, he probably he, wonders about me. Damn a her, but Indian guy. <laughs> oh man. Yeah. <laughs> what if he travels here? What if he travels here to find me? That'd he, be a beautiful love story. Ooh. Man, he's probably out there. It's meant to be then, I think. I'm speaking this. I'm speaking this into existence. Yeah, sorry about all the nasty stuff I shared you guys. Do you have anything That's cool okay. that you have? I, you did show us a cool thing uh, already with Bob and Beth. Oh, yeah, Danny sent me this. <laughs> ben Affleck. <laughs> no, this is my oh, kind of current Is this event. real? Ben Affleck and Jennifer Garner's daughter comes out as trans during her grandfather's funeral. Oh, my God. Serafina Rose, 15, announced her new boy's name, Finn, whilst appearing with her head shaved at a memorial service for her grandfather over the weekend. What? Why didn't she just she, wait? She told the memorial service, which was streamed live on Facebook, Hello, my name is Finn Affleck. Her father, Ben Affleck, is now married to Jennifer Lopez, whose own child, Amy, Emmy is non-binary and uses they them pronouns. Dude, Damn. this is the best. This is the best. This <laughs> you couldn't wait crazy. for like a, a, like a communion party couldn't or wait something. For anything <laughs> else to uh, happen, uh, dude? Like, the, you, well, here's the thing as a parent of a teenager, you know this kind of thing is coming at some sort of family gathering eventually. Eventually, your girl, your daughter freaks out over just like normal development <sighs> stress and they make some kind of scene akin to this. And it's like choosing choosing pop pop's funeral that's like that's tough you dream of that you you like wow man that I, sucks i would have been pissed <laughs> that's a nightmare dude yeah yeah everyone everyone you know you kind of have to just be like fuck <laughs> no i think i hmm. why the funeral 
That's got to suck for a dude from Boston. Sweet dude. till tomorrow. That's I gotta eat do, his dude, ass then. Dude. That's <laughs> got to suck so bad for a dude from Boston. You're at your father's <laughs> funeral. My father just died. And my now fucking my dad daughter's died. Daughter's a queer. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she, no, she's dead to him too. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> lost two that day. God damn, that shit sucks. That's this bizarre. Is, but this is just fifteen, I guess. Yeah. This is this make this is the most relatable thing crushed, huh? Ben Affleck has has ever gone through. No, I really like it when he smokes cigarettes and drinks Dunkin' Donuts and he looks sad all, outside. And he gets fat. <laughs> yeah, he gets fat and looks sad while he smokes cigarettes and yeah. drinks Dunkin' Donuts outside. Damn. No, my, no, my he probably had like two Dunkin' Donuts, two cigarettes <laughs> after this one. <laughs> J Lo, J Lo, why is everyone's daughter, their son? Uh, I don't know, gay. man. I'd say I don't know. It's probably just like you know, cool. You know, this is yeah. uh, this is like Kabbalah now. So <laughs> I don't really have any feelings on it one way or another. I just know, I just know every parent has every parent unfortunate enough to have a teenager at this point has gone through something similar to this. The the non binary thing is pretty tough to watch to watch that kind of thing get like uh, trumpeted by a teenager that you yeah. that you're related to. <laughs> that one's that one's pretty tough. I can imagine. And you just go okay. Yeah, uh, that'd be nice. Go, mm, okay. Yeah, okay, boss. <laughs> and then uh, you just hope you just hope that you're not like indifferent enough that they interpret it as like you being negative. Just stay, yeah. Like, I, I, people's, people's like young nieces and nephews are like making TikToks about them now. Uh, like, like about their, their older relatives. Yeah. Like, uh, one of Mary Jo's friends, uh, got married and one of their like, um, like younger cousins or like nieces or something. She was like an aspiring TikToker hmm. and she had an issue with something at the wedding and like blasted Mary Jo's friend in like a, a pretty like a, a pretty TikTok viewed like, TikTok just like oh. yeah yeah things that your family does at weddings Bro. that's like and she, <laughs> so she had like call her cousin like what are you doing <laughs> why did you do that <laughs> It's like trickled. It's trickled all the way down to just like normal people who I are hope that doesn't happen. Super going for it. I hope that stops <laughs> happening. <laughs> I think it's only gonna get worse. I think so. You'll too. never believe what my uncle Sean said at the wedding. Dude, <laughs> my little cousins are like so skibbity toilet brain. It's crazy. <laughs> They're like grimace shake, skibbity toilet, <laughs> skibbity bup bup. Yes, yes. They're, They're still doing Fortnite things. <laughs> yeah, they are. <laughs> And 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 it freaks me out. Damn! Do they call you the Rizzler? Yeah, we were t we were calling each other. Uncle Rizzlers. Sean's him. We were saying on the first day of Rizmas. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. Man, what the heck else? Oh, sometimes uh, for when they were really young, they thought I was Mr. Beast. Because <laughs> <laughs> I guess their parents told them that I like worked on a YouTube video thing or made YouTube videos or whatever. Damn. And they were like, "Are you Mr. Beast?" They like got really close to me and whispered to me, and were like, "Are you Mr. Beast?" And I was like, "No." <laughs> and this is your secret safe with us, dude. Just let us know. <laughs> it was Mr. Beast. Damn. And yeah, being cool to like, little boys is the best. Yeah, <laughs> that's the best. They love YouTube's. <laughs> it's crazy. Yeah, I uh, doing uh, when 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 kids really started d delving into the skibbity <laughs> lifestyle dude i i mean it, i'm i'm just recalling a time in my life where if you were in a room full of like let's say like a a, a, a boys martial arts class there was a good chance that like four or five of them were doing fortnite dances mm -hmm. at the same time just like <laughs> it uh, fully <laughs> it, it it's I I mean it's on it's on the spectrum somewhere, but I don't think you need to treat it. <laughs> I don't think you need to diagnose it. But it's just like those are just boys having fun. They're boys connected. Will be boys. They're connected to the uh, the boys vibe. They're <laughs> they're tapped in. Skibbity bup bup yes yes. <laughs> <laughs> Who's that guy you're drawing? The disabled man. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, should I have not spoiled it? No, it's okay. okay. No, they're gonna see it soon. Hey, I mean. I, I don't know. I <laughs> this is you know a salute to him. <laughs> That's nice. What's the? I mean, you need to. We need to make sure it's like a celebration of him. You know, it'll be a celebration. <laughs> I don't know. I I think 
I think he ended up in my algorithm because I follow a lady who got her face eaten by a dog, mm. and now she's like a influencer in the uh, facial reconstruction <laughs> surgery uh, space. You it's know, crazy. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know what the uh, advertising money looks like in that, but it's like... Dude, she probably is the pretty queen. good. She is the fucking queen. She's probably get, pretty good. she's getting good. hits, yeah. she's probably making some dough. Yeah. But, uh, damn, I, I remember back when it was just the lady who got her face ripped off by the monkey. Remember her? Yeah, classic. And she kind of didn't even give it all up. Remember she wore the veil on Oprah? And they, Oprah made her take it off. Did she? Yeah, that was the big reveal. I always, I always forget that. I know she wore the big hat. And the beekeeper mask. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I forgot that she. I probably got too bored and turned it off. Yeah, no, that was the big oh. reveal. <laughs> she was, Oprah was like, "Take it off," and she's like, "I don't really want to." And Oprah was like, "Take it off, <laughs> take it <laughs> off." And she took it off. You get one. a new face. You get a new face. <laughs> yeah, that might be the most. Uh, get a round of new. That's faces what she used to say at the. Yeah. Damn, there's a car under your seat. Everyone, look under your seat. <laughs> There's a disabled veteran under your seat. <laughs> no, that's not funny. There's half a nose under I each one of your seats. I shouldn't even joke about that kind of stuff. I shouldn't joke about that. I'm sorry. I <laughs> no, that's okay. Of course I support the troops. No. You guys have a pair of lips under your seat. <laughs> did you guys see The Rock wrestle? Uh, oh, kid, did you see that? No. The Rock wrestled John Cena, and then a surprise guest came out. No, who was it the Undertaker? You're gonna want to pull this up. I did see the I did see the Undertaker come out. Yeah, the under it's the. Undertaker. Did you go to this? <laughs> no, I just watched it on TV. Yeah, I'm I'm sure we can't get away with actually showing it. Uh, Damn, if only this was the U.S. Sumo Championship, we could use ten minutes. Uh, what? Yeah, we have an in with sumo. Really? American sumo, yeah. Yeah, so far that's the only thing we'll be, we're allowed to broadcast is the footage we filmed. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty sick. United States Sumo Championship. Uh, we got tossed by big guys. Really? Mm -hmm. Sounds that sounds scary. Well, they just put it on YouTube. That's crazy. That's awesome. That's that's pretty wild. Oh no, that's WWE an old one. for the oh, children. That's an old one? Yeah, that's an WrestleMania old one. WrestleMania 29, dude. What oh, is this? 2004. It was, it was just WrestleMania 40, bro. Come on, dude. It's yeah, that one. Smell you later. John yeah. Cena's kind of balding. I did see that. Bald Cena. Yeah. I did see that. I saw The Undertaker come back. And Damn, Undertaker kind of, or what's it called? Uh, the Rock's kind of short. No, I uh, think that's he's not. I think it's just, yeah. Do you he's, think? He's, Are they he's, the same the size? Tall. He's big as hell. Is John Cena also Tim, big as hell? Tim, can we please watch John Cena run out, please? Yeah. Um. Tell me what one <laughs> is. It's yeah. that one. It's that, oh, wait. Is it that? Three no, days it's, ago? it's that one. Yeah, it's that one. That one. Yeah. Music. No way. Oh, yeah. Damn, that pop is crazy. <laughs> She's my favorite, dude. Look. <laughs> bow, bow. Damn. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> Let's go. No way. Cena's kind of not looking so good. Roman Reigns, fucking attitude adjustment. Smell you later. Bang. <laughs> He didn't have to take the hat off. No, no. but he wanted he to. He could have kept it on, but he uh, maybe this, he was... I yeah. love how they just reset the tables. <laughs> yeah, it's like the Eric Andre again. show. <laughs> Attitude adjustment onto the table. Big ball. <laughs> <laughs> and look at him. He's like, shit. Uh, he's, he's definitely wait, wait, regretting wait. taking the hat off. No way. Uh -oh. No way! <laughs> uh oh, dude, that's, he looks like God. He is God. Bro. He's got women's pants on and a blouse. <laughs> he's got women's pants and a blouse on, and he's pissed. He's so mad. Damn, he wants to know who left the door open with the AC running. Yeah, he's the boss now. That's his new character. Wow, he'll be like, "You're fired." That what a dynamite top he's wearing. Oh, dude, the pants are a little He's much. the final boss now. The pants are too much, dude. <laughs> dude, he's still Jack Diesel. Cena kind of is getting up there. He dre He's dressed like a guy that like runs a town in Fist of the North Star. <laughs> <laughs> Look at Heyman. He's Elvis, dude. He's the king. They're like, shit, are we doing this? Damn, look how old the fans are. For old time's sake. Damn, look, I mean, look. hold on. Look how homogenized the fans are, dude. This is crazy. Yeah, they're awesome. It's, this is in the link. It's all the... Oh, yeah. I mean, that, it being Philly doesn't have a lot to do with it, I suppose. Mm -hmm. But, like, can I zoom? 
Zoom, baby. I'm trying to zoom. I've been talking about this a lot, but Lemare took me to AEW. It was the most fun thing ever. Really? Have you we sat front row? Have you gone to much wrestling in the past? No, Ooh. never. Yeah, I mean, I've I've uh, I've seen it at every level. I've seen it in a rec center in Kensington <laughs> with an audience of like seven. I went to one of those when I was a kid, but I can't remember. So it. did I. Not in Kensington, but I saw. Uh, what's his name? Eddie Kingston. Is that a guy that's like finally famous? I think I, there's some some Kofi Kingston. Yeah. No, I think it is. It, hold on. Uh, and dude, do, do not think for a second. This yeah, guy, Eddie Kingston. Yeah, this dude's in mm-hmm. AEW, and he finally made it to like a bigish league after being <laughs> like a for real, you know, a small time, a big time little guy forever. Mm-hmm. I saw this guy wrestle in a fucking Kensington Rec Center. No <laughs> way. Yeah, and it was like, pr- it was probably the coolest thing me and my friends w- pr- <laughs> ever could have experienced <laughs> being there. Being there to see to see kind of big dudes take like pretty nasty bumps, it was just like, I, it was rapturous. Mm-hmm. It was the, it, it, the 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 world was crumbling under us. It was so fucking cool. Yeah, I was I was having a lot of fun, way more fun than I expected to have. Uh, I took Mary Jo to a Ring of Honor show while she was pregnant with uh, one of our kids. I can't remember <laughs> which one. Yeah, there's some. It's it's electrifying. No, you can't. I dude, I watched. I we had backyard wrestlers in my high school, and the, in the locker room every day, they would put on a show. Wow! Every single day, these guys that were like two grades ahead of me were putting on a pretty nasty, high level backyard wrestling show in the hmm. locker room. That's so sick. That is everyone sick. would be late for class because these dudes were like, th- uh, like going off of benches and hitting the floor so fucking hard, wow. and you'd just be like. How in the hell, dude? <laughs> really crazy stuff. You're gonna hurt yourself. <laughs> That's my favorite thing to do when I watch wrestling with Lamar. Though, is be like, "Oh my god, how is he gonna get up from that one?" I, say that every time. I can't help but just talk the entire match. Be like, "Oh my god!" And then what's his face? Seth freaking Rollins. He has a bum knee. No. And they were really targeting that knee in the tag match oh, on the first no. night. Did they the close a chair on it and then stomp on it? They kind of did stuff oh, like they put it around the thing, the the they wrapped the, around the and then they post. <clears throat> did they, they didn't hit it with and the metal stairs? What? Did they? I think they may have hit it with. I think they threw the f- fucking kitchen sink at Seth freaking Rollins' knee. No way, dude. And then guess what? He wrestled the next day for the title. How would he do? Lost, I think. I mean, with the, they were killing his when knee, you, and you wonder just how how could that have gone? You know, if he didn't have the knee thing. If he didn't, before. like that's, I don't know why he was you. wrestling hurt. That haunts you for the rest of your career. Mm-hmm. That's one of the big like, what could have you know could have been, mm-hmm. and it's like, damn, dude, you know, I don't know. That's tough to come back from. <laughs> but <laughs> yeah, Seth freaking Rollins. Lots of love to Seth Rollins. Tough man. Yeah, you know, it's a tough Get sport. Well soon. It's a tough sport, dude. You know, mm-hmm. people forget that. <laughs> It's full contact. It's still real to me, they damn think, it. People think it's all like fun and like, you know. People don't realize there's a title on the line, dude. And and how much how much are you willing to like give up to get that? And it's just, you know, whatever. Do you even care about sacrifice? You know? C- I do. Civilians don't know about it though. Yeah. No, you know, they can't. <sighs> yeah. We met the wrestlers, they were nice. We met Gold Dust. Oh, that's sick. Did you meet the wrestlers because they knew they like, like uh, Lemaire like knew somebody went. that worked there, I guess, and they got us back. And then we Ooh. sat right in the front, right next to the ring. That's cool. Wait for AEW or for for AEW? Whoa! It was so sick. And in uh, what's his name? Jeff the Hardy Bros were there. How were they? How did they look? <laughs> <laughs> They're getting up there. Honestly, all respect to the Hardy Bros, but I think Jeff Hardy got hurt for real because he like whispered into the guy's ear, and then the guy was just like. And pinned him real quick, and then they like dragged him out of there, and he was spitting up blood and stuff. No way! I think he. Well, do you know the history of those guys? Triple flip. You know the history of the Hardy Boys. I know. I remember them from when I was a kid, like liking them. Yeah, WWE. Swanton Bomb. Yeah, they they both I think partied way too hard, and uh, like ruined their careers (laughs) over and over again. (laughs) And but that's why I'm asking. Like I'm asking about them like a like a cousin that I knew that went to rehab. <laughs> How do you, how's he doing? How's he doing? Are they doing good? <laughs> yeah, they seem. To, I mean, how are the Hardy Boys? Jeff is still wrestling. Matt was chilling on the side of the ring. 
I do. I think about like guys like them, guys like uh, like the ECW guys, and I just I would love um, an accurate uh, depiction of like like how hard those dudes were were partying on the road, like how hard they were chasing pussy, how fucked up they were getting. Mm. I would I would love. Don't don't they have movies like that? I guess so, but I I guarantee they're lying a little bit. I think they might have been the nastiest dudes. For just from yeah, I'm still, actually I'm no, like, I think that's like a, the stereotype. They're all fucking pieces of shit. <laughs> yeah, they're just road dogs getting they're pussy all and getting fucked up. Debaucherous uh, machines, fucking scoundrels, dude. Mm-hmm. Dirty rotten scoundrels. Rap scallions. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I want to. I want. I want that. That's probably all in the dark side of wrestling stuff, and I'm just. I'm, yeah, I sound like a fucking ignorant <laughs> dickhead right now. You so ignorant, Tim. Yeah. You ignorant. Can I? Can I ask you? Uh, how how it's been, like traveling for yourself? It's nice, so far. Yeah. I haven't done it as, that much yet, but I'm going to soon. I gotta bring a friend. I'll probably kill myself if I don't. Yeah, it seems pretty depressing alone. I don't know though. I was uh, well. I wanted to say because uh, King Soul brought you that marvelous Marlboro jacket. Big Every- Willie. I get I get so jammed up about um, traveling and everywhere I go, it's just nothing but like pretty fired up dudes that are like, it's nice. Yeah, I do it's kind of cool. stress about I'm, it. I'm getting bit. very gay right now. I need to pull out of this. <laughs> I'm okay. sorry. I like it. I'm it sorry. Cool. No, Danny, tell me about something cool. I'm fucking, sp- <laughs> I'm, sp- I'm. Why don't you just be I'm your not, fucking self, You're not Tim. being gay. For once in your goddamn life. No, I just really want to talk to my friends. Express <laughs> yourself. I'm excited yeah. to travel. You've been having a fun, of, like a ton of fun on the road, dude. Yeah. Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I just want to hang out with my friends, man. You are. <laughs> well, that's what we're doing right now. Let me find something nice. Let me find something. That, here we go. Is this? That looks pretty nice to me. <laughs> no, that's just foreign guys. <laughs> that's just foreign guys. Hold on. Give me a minute here. You got it. Oh, I saw this. <laughs> Damn, rest in peace. He had a good run. He passed away? <laughs> no, he didn't die. Why is he... Yeah, why he's is like for World of T-Shirts doing that? Like, who's coming after him? Why is he running so... I don't know. He's like... A, he's so fucked up. He's getting so drunk, dude. He's like a drunk, right? Yeah. He's drunk as a skunk. That. What is this? It's World of Shirts. It's World of T-Shirts. What's he... It was just he was click just on like, the hashtag. You you never seen. I don't even know. It's, he's just like this autistic kid who moved to New York City, depressing. and then people kind of like got him to start drinking a lot, and now he just has an insane drinking problem, and he just runs around the city like throwing up and yeah. being blackout drunk, and like cops like arresting him, stuff like that. Is this him? Yeah. Yeah, but I think he's 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 digressed. Wish we could turn back time <laughs> to the good old days. When our mama sang us to sleep, but now we're stressed out. Damn, let's okay. go world of t-shirts. So, and this is this is how he started out? I think yeah, so, yeah. Yeah, he's doing pretty bad. And then, uh, I guess he got... Oh, man. He drinks a lot and, like, argues with black people, I think. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh. what? <laughs> Coffee and boba. Wait, are these dudes friends? Hold on, I need to. No, they're enemies. They started. What? They, Those two are enemies. They're I'm pretty beefing? sure. Yeah, they. Well, they've always had beef because they were like two just like retarded content creators <laughs> on TikTok. They were just doing like wild shit, <sighs> and they've gone on very similar trajectories. And then I think they met up one time, and they did not like each other. They didn't vibe at all. Not at all. <laughs> okay, he's drinking. Yeah, he likes to drink. This is me. This is me last night. You got to stop with this rock and roll lifestyle. <laughs> is he... Dude, come on, man. I'm... <laughs> <laughs> is he... Da... <laughs> it's just him getting a couple sips. <laughs> he's just taking sips. So he's he's... This is from... He's intellectually like something I think else, so, yeah. right? Absolutely. Get to videos of him talking and running around and stuff. Yeah, he'll cause Are trouble. Are we almost done here? 
That's up to the We're host. done whenever you want to be whenever, done. Whenever you're done, we can be done. Okay, let's go to a bar. Wow. <laughs> we could get a drink and get some food. One day at a time, and that's what, when you go to meetings, we, that's yeah, the whole thing that it bar. goes. We'll go get um, one but I think it's like important to know that food. he's at least yeah. trying to cut it down, and it can't happen overnight. Yeah, I could Life get sucks, one suck beer harder, you know? Like. Thank you guys. Anytime you want to come on, John. We'll get him to you. Yeah, what the fuck? Yeah, that makes me pretty sad. What? I think I just disassociated for a long time. Hold on. Zin, I'll get withdrawals. Oh, I saw that yeah. one. Yeah. I'll get withdrawals. a nicotine withdrawal. I'll get a nicotine <laughs> withdrawal. <laughs> that was Tim like a month ago. What happened? I didn't talk like this. Yeah, but that you was you? Through, he was going through Zin, nicotine withdrawals. You were? Yeah. He started smoking blunts and then he yeah. started to get nicotine withdrawals. I gave it I gave it an honest shot, dude. I was trying to, <laughs> I was trying something here. I mean, I'm trying something new. I'm stepping out of my comfort zone and you're fucking pooping on me like this. Crazy. That's you don't wild. Like that man. he smokes blunts now, no? No, I think it's fine, but I was like, dude, you're going you're going to go down a dark path and you're going to get addicted to nicotine. <laughs> and then two, <laughs> 2 weeks prior, me and Noah spent like a half hour being like, dude, you don't want to do this. Yeah, you're going to get you're going to get sucked in. I was trying to just uh like moderate moderate uh, nicotine use. And it, it quickly too. it quickly got way too demanding for me. <clears throat> yeah. It was an unsustainable it started with this makes me feel good. I'm I'm pretty sharp when I smoke weed. I don't feel weird. Into, uh, yeah, when I'm not uh, days that I'm not smoking blunts, I get fucking furious. <laughs> yeah, since I can't since I can't like smoke blunts during the day. Yeah, these in so you don't get the withdrawals. <laughs> but my my question is, and I want to um, we're gonna uh, take a break in a second. My question is, is like, why why is the portal to this? opened why like i don't know but it's making me a little sad this is this is because <laughs> anybody can get a phone dude anybody can get a phone and do whatever now. i know i know i know but like there's like production right. in You're this right now. it's like oh well that's just a podcast i know that's yeah, not yeah. his I know, podcast i know it's not his podcast i'm just i'm like the this is uh i the 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 breadth of human experience i think sometimes spins me completely out <laughs> how is there room in the universe for this and and then how does this like how does how does getting a glimpse of it make its way into a, a group consciousness this Dude, this torment yeah have you guys come across Javi, the drug twitter guy no he just like smokes perks and fentanyl oh jeez you can smoke pills yeah apparently I think I guess grounding him for basing him. <laughs> what the hell? I haven't man? seen Javi. But he seems like kind of a bummer too. He's just these are, Yeah, know, it's all bummer. Like it Twitter does it to me on the for you. They're like, yeah, you'll like this. The a lot of the and it just it's always <laughs> bumming me out. Yeah, I and and because it knows it will, and that's why but uh, <laughs> duh who right? But so much of what I'm seeing is just like <laughs> intellectually disabled people like just giving you the opportunity to stare at them at the mall mm. that's the itch <laughs> this is we have we the human beings have not evolved past the impulse to shit to stare at absolute freakazoids <laughs> little people you know spaz spaz spazzes. yeah spaz spaz <laughs> spastics and but and, and then so now you have the opportunity to just like it gorge yourself on it and from what i'm seeing i mean look at these numbers man a lot of people are <laughs> yeah that's right he's fa he's famous we're gonna get we're, we're gonna be get like a social diabetes from i think <laughs> swallowing this back down <laughs> you know i think yeah, that's what i that's right. what i think <laughs> i'm a little scared <laughs> I, I mean this definitely isn't good but it's like i think it uh, in I a feel way pretty it bad is. for him because it's like i think it's it's I'm I'm always interested in like you know what are people's lives like and it's like you, this guy's really putting his you know his heart on his sleeve, and I just like seeing that. I don't know, man. I don't know. Like it's definitely bad, like the path that he's going down. But I like that there's like a a guy like this doing stuff. St maybe not necessarily getting so fucked up, but I like that he's uh 
you know, he's out there putting stuff out. Okay. <laughs> great. Yeah, great take, Noah. Thank you. <laughs> I don't know. I just think, like, I, uh, you, you, this isn't like... You got, you're saying, you, but you got to give it up for him. Yeah, like, this guy isn't fascinating to you? I, yeah, he is, though, but it's like, how much stuff can I take in? <laughs> mm-hmm. I don't know. You don't need to... I, I don't know. You don't need to really commit this to anything. I think that it, it's good that he's out there. <laughs> You don't need to consume it all the time, but it's good that he's out True. there. I do. He's like, That's yeah. where we disagree. He's like soda, dude. <laughs> all right, we're gonna let's take a, let's take a break. Okay. <laughs> let's drink some water. Yeah, I need some water. And we're gonna hop over and uh, uh, continue over at uh, patreoncom slash Um Tell them about your your road dates, Sean. Please. Oh, I'm in the Midwest. Please come to my shows in the Midwest in Batavia, Illinois, St. Louis, Missouri. Uh, Indianapolis, Columbus, Spokane, Tacoma. It's all on my Instagram page. Please. Thank you guys for having me on. Sorry I was kind of quiet. And no, you're a great dude. No, I'm going to I'm going to do the opposite. I might puke in the break. <laughs> I should I should I should have recorded these backwards and done like really cool stuff up front and then all the bummer stuff on the back end, but we'll, we're we're going to turn it around. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> Oh, come see me at Soul Jewels, May 18th. TimButterly.com for tickets. I love you. I'll see you guys later. Thank you. Oh, wait, the painting. You guys know. Oh, yeah. I've been painting. staring at it. I've, I've, I've been forgetting. watching you. Dude. The Are guys gonna, haven't seen it. Are you going to show them? Yeah. <laughs> 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 this is where we're at so far. I like it. This is his, his dashboard confessional. You know? Yeah. Wait till I add his fucking grotesque features. Hang in there, no. baby. Hang in there, baby. <laughs> I mean, I have to show what he looks like, dude. Mm-hmm. You can see where it's going to go. Yeah, I think it looks great. Man. I think it's going to go good. <laughs> I think so, too. All right. <laughs> see you guys in a minute. God bless you. Bye. <laughs>